29, take my yoke upon you and learn Can you learn matututo? from me. Amen. Sino pong makanta yung kanta ng araw? I wanna be like Mike. I wanna be like Mike. I don't want to be like Mike. <laughs> I want to be like Jesus. Amen. And learn Sabi na ba kayo, for I am gentle and lowly in heart. And you will find rest. Woo! What a promise. You will find rest for your souls. Amen? Salamat po sa wala kayong response doon. Yan ay sa salita mismo na nanggaling sa bibig ng Diyos. Minsan nadi-discourage tayo dahil sa kaganapan. Nadi-discourage tayo sa mga nangyayari sa ating buhay. Sabi ng Panginoon, learn from me. Learn from me and you will find rest. Amen. Amen po ba? Kasi po pag pinairal natin yung ating damdamin, lalo tayo manghihina. Lalo na magkaroon ka pa ng kapitbahay na napaka-chismosa. At magkaroon ka ng kaibigan na nega, puro negative ang sinasabi. Alam mo, itong pandemic, ang daming nagkira. At ang dito ba? Yan na malapit na ba? May COVID part 2, part 3, part 4. Kaya kapag may pera ka, mag-grossing ka rin ka. Ikaw lang pera ka, ginamit mo na yung credit card mo, pinatak mo yung laman ng pure, pure gold. Kasi nagpanig-bahing ka na. Huwag mo kayo magpapanig-bahing. God will provide. Can you say that? Hallelujah! Puri po ang Diyos na buhay. Now, let's talk about the ark. Ark na po mag-uusapan natin. Ha? Since the ark is a type of Jesus. The ark is made of wood. Sabi mo, wood. Wood. Saan gawa yung cross? Oh. <laughs> Amen? Amen? The ark is made of wood. Amen. Amen. Now, who engineered the ark? Para po maliwanan, the one who engineered the cross is God Himself. The one who engineered the ark is not Noah. Bakit? Wala pa kung subject si Noah nung araw na design 101. Amen. Wala pa yeah. Amen. Wala pa. Strength of materials, wala pa rin siya. Amen. Subject na ganun. Amen po ba? Kinematics, wala pa rin siya. Amen? Wala siya kinematics. Sino pa rin yung mga engineering students? Siguro rin tindin yung mga sinasabi ko, no? O, wala pa siyang mga kinematics ng araw. At saka yung mathematics niya, wala pa. Wala pa. Algebra nga yata, wala pa si Noah nung araw, eh. Amen po ba? How much more? Kapag ikaw maging engineering, uh, yung mga yung mga architect, amen? Magkakaroon kayo ng math. Higher math. Differential calculus, integral calculus, differential equations. Amen po ba? Kinematics. Advance algebra pang high school lang yun. Eh, mo ba, pag nandun na kayo sa inyong ano, hindi, 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 hindi. Ma, 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 you go to higher maths. Eh, si Noah, hindi pa po nagmamath nun, si Noah. Amen. Amen? Now, look, look, at the, look at the design. Hallelujah. Genesis 6. Hallelujah. Genesis chapter 6. Amen. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. You go to verse 14 of Genesis 6. Hallelujah. Sabi ng Panginoon, Make yourself an ark of copper wood. Nakadescribe pa ko anong klaseng wood ang nagamitin. Kasi kung maraming wood, baka ko ko lumber. Amen. Ang sinabi gamitin mo, copper wood. Ang copper wood po, ito ang pinakamatigas na kahoy doon sa mundo. Ng Lebanon. Can we say amen? Ngayon, make rooms Make rooms in the ark and cover it inside and outside with a pitch. Pitch. Yun mong pitch na to, yung tinatawag na pandike. Ito yung nanggaling din sa puno. Now, ito, sabi nito, cover it inside and outside. Church, meron ang susabihin sa inyo. We were redeemed by the blood of Jesus. You are covered inside and outside. You are covered in body, soul, and spirit. Hallelujah. And the typology in Jesus Christ. Hallelujah. That the wood, hallelujah, it's not an ordinary wood. 
the body of Christ, it is the body without spot, without blemish. Hallelujah. At saka yung kanyang dugo, ayun po, ang nag-cover sa atin. You are covered by the blood of Jesus inside and outside. Amen. Can you say amen? amen. At ito po yung nangyari doon sa heart. Now, it's a, and this is how you shall make it. Verse 15. The length of the ark shall be 300 cubits. One cubit is 18 inches. Amen? Ang isang cubit po is 18. Sa so, i-multiply mo yan by 18, yung 300, multiply by 18, para makuha mo sa feet, divide by 12. Amen. Ganun po kahaba yung ark. Amen po ba? Ganun kahaba yung, and its width is 50 cubits. Yung 50 na naman, i-multiply mo by 18, divide by 12, yun po yung lapad niya sa feet. And its height is 30 cubits. Did you see the number 3 always there? Amen. 3 is the number of God. 5 is the number of grace. Amen. Did you see the church? Ganun po katalino ang Panginoon. Hallelujah. You shall make a window, verse 16, for the ark, and you shall finish it to a cubit from above and set the door of the ark in its side. You shall make it lower second and third decks. So, ilang decks mo yung ark? Tatlo. Yung Titanic kita. Tingnan mo, yung Titanic made of steel, engineered by the finest people in the world. Lumubo. Yung Noah's ark made of wood. Amen po ba? Inatake ng mga bato, inatake ng mga puno, marami pong binaggahan, hindi lumubo. Amen. Why? It's made of God. Amen. And made by God. I mean. Can we say amen? Sa so, untarang yung Titanic, sabi ng mga tao ng araw, amen. yung mga reporter, hindi mapapalubog basta-basta ito. Eh, unang paglalayag pa lang niya, bulumubog na siya. Amen. Meron pong papatulayan sa atin ng Panginoon doon. It's not by might. Amen. It's not by power. But my spirit saith the Lord. Amen. Kaya minsan po, minsan masyado tayong kumpiyansa sa mga ginagawa natin. Huwag kapatid, sa Panginoon lang. Amen. Lahat ng papuri, lahat ng pasasalamat, sa Panginoon lang. Huwag tayong magkumpiyansa sa mga gawa natin. Hallelujah! Sometimes, merong incident sa Bible. Hallelujah! Giniba niya yung ganyang kabalik. Sino mo kabasa nun? Pagkatapos nagtayo siya ng malalaking kabalik. Hallelujah! Then, nagtrabaho siya, masipag siya, nagtrabaho siya. Yung araw, ginawa niyang araw. Yung gabi, ginawa niyang araw. At yung gabi-gabi pa rin, eh, araw pa rin. Hallelujah. Pinuno niya yung kanyang kamalik. At nung magpuno niya yung kanyang kamalik, sabi niya, Hi! Puno na yung kamalik ko. Wala na akong gagawin ngayon. Kundi kumain, kumino, at magsaya. Amen. Sabi ni Lord, Ngayong gabi, I will commit your soul. Ang tanong, sino na kinabang? Walay. Eh, may buwa, why? Kasi masyado na siyang nagmalaki sa kanyang sariling lakas. Trust in the Lord with all that heart. Lean not on thy own understanding. And in all thy ways, I mean all thy ways, acknowledge Him. And He shall direct thy path. Para pang nga natin ang Diyos ng buhay. Hallelujah. Now, the one who engineered is God. Pagkatapos nun, lumipat ka ng verse 18 of this end chapter, Genesis 6. Go to verse 18. Amen. 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 Sabi ng verse, I will establish my covenant with you, and you shall go into the ark. Church, listen. If you go into the ark, the covenant is established. Tama yung sinabi ni Jesus. Apart from me, you can do nothing. Amen. Yung dove, alam niya yung resting place na yung ark. Sabi ng Panginoon, I will establish my covenant with you and you shall go into the ark. You, your sons, your wife, and your sons' wives with you. Acts 16.31, believe on the Lord Jesus Christ, you and your family shall be saved. Amen. Can we say Amen. Hallelujah. So, makita po natin after the flood, marami po tayong matututulang dito sa Noah's Ark. Amen. Now, if you will go to verse 19, and every living thing of all flesh, 
You shall bring two of every sort into the ark to keep them. To keep them. I know. Alive. So if you will bring these things into the ark, they will be alive. Mabubuhay sila. Hindi lamang yung mga yung mga species, hindi lamang yung mga animals, kundi lahat ng nasa ark mabubuhay. Church, listen. You want to live? Get inside the ark. You want to be healed? Get inside the ark. Hallelujah. You want miracles? Get inside the ark. If you want to be prolonged, get inside the ark. Gusto mo bumabang buhay mo? Get inside the ark. Gusto mo hindi ka ng COVID-19? Get inside the ark. Who is the ark? The ark is Jesus. Amen. Male and female. Tignan mo ha. This is the power of grace. Hindi chinek ni Lord kung sino yung ipapasok ni Noah sa ark. Amen. Hindi siya namili. Hindi siya namin, Noah, huwag mong ipasok yan. Magiging troublemaker yan. Wala. Lahat ng punta doon pinapasok. Amen. The same thing with the love of God. The same thing with the love of Jesus. Whosoever believeth in Him, whosoever believeth in Him, ikaw man ang pinakamasama-sama-sama, ikaw man ang pinakasinungaling sa mga sinungaling, hallelujah, ikaw man yung isinusukan ng lipunan, ikaw man yung inaayawan, whosoever believeth in Him, should not perish but have eternal life. Amen. Ikaw man ang kriminal sa mga kriminal, hallelujah, if you go in the ark, and you decided to get inside the ark, you are welcome. Amen. God is no respecter of person. Amen. Amen. The peach, yung pong pinangsil sa ark. The peach. Sabi mo peach. Ito pong tawag dito ay sealant. Amen. Sealant. Yung pagsisil. Yung pong nagsil sa, sa ark. Amen. Sealant. Hallelujah. The, ang, ang, ang purpose, it is applied inside and outside. Amen. Can you say that? Pero yung blood po ni Jesus, once na tinanggap po natin, kasi sabi ng iba, ito po yung mga religyoso, pag tinanggap po si Jesus, magpapahid ka na kanyang dugo, labas at loob ng iyong katawan. Amen? Sabi ng iba, kasi pag sinabi mo rao, Lord, pahihilan mo ko na yung banal na dugo, baka labas lang yung pinahiran. Ano palagay mo kay Lord? When God do His work, He did it completely. Amen. Kaya nga po yung armor of God, sabi ng iba, may mga turo ko sa Ephesians 6 eh. Pagkaroon ka ng helmet of salvation, pagkaroon ka ng sword of spirit, pagkaroon ka ng breastplate of righteousness, pagkaroon ka ng ng shoe. Bakit siya natalo? Incomplete. Anong incomplete? Hindi kompleto yung kanyang, yung kanyang, ano, yung kanyang armor. Ang Panginoon, pag nagbigay ng armor, kompleto, why? He entered the most holy place once. Yeah. Once. Isang beses lamang siya pumasok. And the one, na, yung isang beses na pagpasok niya, your salvation is complete. Yeah. Hmm. Kompleto po yun. At saka isa po, once na tinanggap natin, automatic po yun, pumunta sa atin. Sabi mo sa katabi mo, I think you have a dog spirit. Kasi nakikinig ka eh. Pag-grave eh, di ka pakikinig. Dog spirit. Can you say amen? amen? Now, let's talk about the blood. Nakita ninyo yung, yung ark. Lahat na pumasok will have come. Tama ba? Yung raven po, galing sa ark. Si Lucifer, kriniate yan, ni Lord. Amen. Amen po ba? Lucifer and one-third of the angels were created by God. Amen. Wala pong kriniate si Lucy. Amen. Wala siyang kriniate. Amen? Wala siyang kriniate ang nag-create sa kanya, si Lord. Amen. Amen. Now, yung raven po, hallelujah, came from the ark. Now, it doesn't matter who we are. 
Amen po ba? Kapag pinag-usapan na po yung application ng blood. Amen? Now, if we will go to Exodus 12. Tingnan natin yung Exodus 12. Amen? Can you say amen? Hallelujah. Na hindi din yung po yung preaching. Malalim ba? O na, na. I'm praying to God that I can explain it to you in a way na maintindihan natin. Amen. Amen po ba? Now, nasa chapter 25 na po ako. Nasa 5 pa lang itong tinuturo ko sa inyo. So, ilang weeks po ang isang taon? 52. 52. 52. 52. 52. 52. So, kulang pa ako ng 25 pa lang eh. Kulang pa ako ng 27. Kasi bubuhay ko po, ang pangalan ng preaching itong buong tato is after the flood. Amen? After the flood. This is part 5. Amen? Para kapag may compilation po kayo, maganda. Amen? Are you church? Amen. Palang pangalan ng Panginoon. Hallelujah. Glory. Hallelujah. Now, Exodus 12. This is the power of the pitch or the blood. Verse 12. For I will pass through the land of Egypt on the night, and I will strike all the firstborn the land of Egypt, both men and the beast. Both men and beast. Nangyari po ito nung Noah's flood. Pati yung mga beast na namatay. And against all the gods of Egypt, I will execute judgment. I am Verse 13. Ito na po yung makikita natin. The grace, now the blood. Sabi mo blood. Shall be a sign for you in the houses where you are. And when I see the blood. Hindi sinabi dito when I see you. Sinabi dito when I see the blood. When I see the ceiling. I will pass over you. So ang passes po natin, the blood. And the flame shall not be on you to destroy you when I strike the land of Egypt. Amen po ba? So, makikita po natin na yung pong pitch o yung seal o yung blood, yung po yung ating passes. The same thing with the ark. Hallelujah. Kaya nga po yung ark, hallelujah, lahat na nakapasok doon ay safe. Even though ito ay bumangga sa malalaking puno, bumangga sa malalaking bato, hallelujah, even though ito po ay uh, maraming mga mga nasa kasahan na malalaking mga debris, nothing happened because the ark is covered with a pitch. Church, listen. COVID-19, COVID-20, COVID-21, or 22, kahit ano pa ang dahanan natin, you are safe. Amen. Why? You are covered with the blood. Amen. Amen po ba? You are covered with the blood. When I see the blood, sabi na pagkano, when I see the blood, hallelujah, I will not let the destroyer destroy you. Amen. When I see the blood. Whose blood? Kanyang yung blood ba ito, Panginoon? Jesus. Amen. Tingnan natin sa Bible lang. Go to Hebrews 9. Hallelujah. Kanyang, para makita natin, maintindihan natin kanyang blood ito. Amen. Kailangan po biblical concept. Hebrews chapter 9. Hallelujah. Hebrews chapter 9. Amen. Let's go to verse 12. Hallelujah. Ito lang matalas ginagawa. Now with the blood of goats and calves, but with his own blood, with his own blood, Amen. he entered the most holy place once. Ilang beses? Once. So completo. Okay. Once for all. So kahit ano pang status mo, having obtained eternal redemption. Ito po yung sinasabi, you can never lose the salvation because the salvation that Jesus made is perfect. Amen. Amen. Pero bakit ang tao ay bumabalik sa dati? Bumabalik ka sa dati, ibig sabihin, that's your own prerogative, that's your own choice. It's not the choice of God, it's not the will of God, the will of God is to save us. Can you say that? Can you say amen? Yes. Hallelujah. Kasi po yung word na you lost your salvation, mali yung word na yun eh. Kapag nalulos mo yung salvation mo, ibig sabihin, the power of the cross is not enough. You lost your salvation because in the first place, you are not saved. 
Hallelujah. Amen. Tinuro ko na ito dito. Kung pabasahin yung sa 1 John, wala pong, wala pong tinatawag na backslider. Wala po. It's only the word of a man. In the first place, sabi ko sa 1 John, He is with us. Hallelujah. He went out from us because in the first place, He doesn't belong to us. Amen. Ang liwalimalag po nun eh. Amen po ba? Kaya nga po yung isa sabi na nagbackslide. Huwag kayo maniniwala. Because the, the salvation that Jesus did is perfect. Amen. Ayaw ko sa inyo ha, pero sa akin, naniniwala ko, lahat ng ginawa ni Jesus perfect. Amen. Wala siyang ginawa na hindi perfect. Amen po ba? Lahat ng ginawa niya perfect. He's an awesome God. He's a great God. The great healer. Sabi nga ni David, who remembers, hallelujah, not my iniquities. Amen. Who forgives all my sins and doesn't remember my iniquities, who heals all my sicknesses and diseases. Amen. Can you say amen? amen? Oh, glory to God. Hallelujah. Amen po ba? Makita natin, ngayon kinonfirm ito ni Jesus. Sinabi ni Jesus, yung blood, akin. Amen? Ang bilis-bilis naman ang oras. Amen. Hallelujah. Uh, meron pong part 5, second part sa Sunday. Tutuloy mo. Amen. Amen po ba? Now, Titignan po natin lang yun. Dito tayo matatapos sa confirmation ni Jesus. Amen? Go to 1 Corinthians. Ito po si Jesus mismo nag-confirm yung blood niya. Amen? Hallelujah. 1 Corinthians. Go to chapter 11. Kinonfirm niya mismo na ito ay kanyang tugo. Verse 23 of 1 Corinthians chapter 11. For I received from the Lord that which I also delivered to you, the Lord Jesus. The Lord Jesus. Amen. On the same night in which he was betrayed, took bread. Go to verse 24. See Jesus to up. And when he had given thanks, he broke it and said, Take it. This is my body, which is broken for you. Can you sing that? So, sinasabi ni Jesus, the ark, that's me. Amen. And do this in remembrance of me. Now, let's go to verse 25. In the same manner, he took the cup after supper, saying, this cup is the new covenant in my blood. Niliwana din niya. This goes on what is drink in remembrance of me. So, ibig sabihin, yung blood, which is our eternal, amen, salvation, which is our eternal refuge, sabi mo refuge, resting place, is none other than Jesus. Amen. At liwanan po niya, no? Amen po ba? Napakaliwanan. Yung mga ayaw kilalanin si Jesus, hallelujah, bumising na po tayo sa katotohanan. At liwanan dito, napakaliwanan na sinasabi ni Jesus, ako yung tinapay ng buhay, ako yung dugo, hallelujah, na nabubo sa krus ng kalbaryo. Nililiwanag na rin ang, ang liwanag po. Ito po yung ng ating Panginoon. Amen. So, Jesus confirmed His blood. Amen. Ano bang klaseng dugo ito? One more verse. Ephesians 5. Go to Ephesians 5 para makita natin anong klaseng dugo meron si Jesus. Ephesians 5. Verse 27. Hallelujah. Ephesians 5, 27. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Are you there, church? Amen. That He might present her. Yung her. Sino yung her? Binanggit ko sa kanina. Sino yung her? Yung her tayo. The bride. Amen. Praise the Lord. Pinagpala ka, bro. Basta may binabanggit mong small age sa Bible, it pertains to the church, Amen. the bride. That he might present her to himself as glorious church, Amen. not having spot or wrinkle Amen. or any such thing, but that she should be, you know, she, the bride, right. she should be holy and without Amen. blemish. Paano ka naging holy? Because of the blood of Jesus. Hindi, hindi ka naging holy dahil ikaw ay mabait. Hindi ka naging holy kasi dahil mahaba lang yung bestida mo. At kung maglakad ka, ipakinyan. Hindi ka naging holy doon. Hindi ka naging holy kasi hindi ka naging ikaw. 
Hindi ka naging holy kasi hindi ka nagme-makeup. Hindi ka naging holy kasi hindi ka nagpaputol ng buhok kahit umabot na siya, kahit maputi na ang buhok mo. Hindi ka naging holy dahil doon. Amen. Naging holy ka dahil sa dugo ni Jesus. Amen. Hindi ka naging holy dahil uh, sinusunod mo yung alitong doon na kung ano-ano man. Bawal ang makeup, bawal ang lipstick, bawal uminom ng Coca-Cola kasi parang katawan ng babae. Amen. Hindi ka naging holy doon. No, no, no. You, you never became holy because of that. You became holy because of the blood. Amen. Can you say amen? Hindi ka naging holy dahil religyoso ka na. Hindi, hindi. Hindi ka naging holy dahil doon, religyoso ka na. You became holy because of the blood. Amen. Can you say amen? Amen. Sabi mo sa katabi mo, banal ka. Yung iba kasi ayaw ng gabi na banal si. Hindi ang banal. Hello ka, mali na banal. Banal ka. Banal ka. Dahil sa banal na dugo na Jesus. Amen. You're holy. Amen. Can you say that? Amen. Sabi mo, sabi mo, sabi mo, sabi mo, sabi mo, you're holy. Basta pag, pag dinideclare mo kasi she or he is holy, you are declaring the accomplishment of Jesus Christ. Yeah. Amen. Ang dinideclare mo si Jesus na naging holy siya dahil kay Jesus. Yeah. Hindi siya naging holy dahil mabait siya. Hindi siya naging holy kasi hindi siya makabasag pinggan. Hindi siya makabasag pinggan kasi hindi siya nagililigpit. <laughs> Para ka makakabasag ng pinggan, hindi ka naguhugas. Hindi siya makabasa ng pinggan. I believe. <laughs> so church, listen. I will continue this next week. Amen? Amen. Parang pa ka natin. Let's all stand. Hallelujah. Tinatay mo pa ako ng assistant pastor ko. Hallelujah. Praise the Lord. Mawin po tayo na isang awitin. The ark. Yun po yung way. God is a way maker. Sabi mo, way maker. Way maker. Yung mark. Way maker. Sino ba yung gustong magpuri sa Panginoon dahil na ang Panginoon? Yeah. Ang sasabi mo, God is a way maker. Yung mong art is one of the way that God made. He's a way maker. Kaya pong sabi ni Jesus, I am the way, the truth, Engineered by God Himself. And His name is 